everyone and welcome to Hair Tutorial Tuesday. This week I'm going to be showing you how to do a four strand braid. So I just did a little braid into a side braid. Um, I just feel like I said braid so many times right now. But I'm going to get a little closer you can see. So as you can see it's just like four strands. So there's one more strand than the everyday three strand braid. So it's a little bit different and you can get different styles um, depending on how big the chunks of hair are. So if we have like two big ones, two small ones, or like all the same size or all little ones. It just like makes it different, but I'm just gonna be showing you how to do this today. And by the way, this is the nail tutorial that I posted yesterday, if you can actually see it. Maybe you can't see, but I did cartoony ooze and skulls nails. So if you haven't seen that video, go check it out because I just want you to, so go check it out. You go check it out right now. Well, after you see this video. But anyways, I'm going to be doing this today, and let's go ahead and get started. First, brush out your hair to detangle it of any knots because knots are no good, and we don't like knots in our hair. So just go ahead and brush it out until it's all nice and tangle-free so that the braiding will be much easier. Now, I'm going to do like a little chunk on the right side of my head, so I'm taking a little piece of hair and then tucking the rest of my hair over to my other side and then I'm just going to brush it out to make sure there's no knots at all on the piece that I'm going to be working on so that it's nice and easy to use, I mean braid. So you're going to divide it into four sections, try to get it as equal as you can. You'll get different looks depending on what you do but what I like to do is take the piece on the right, cross it over and then under the next piece and then over again and then you're going to repeat that same process. You're going to take the piece from the right Go over, then under, and then over. So as you can see, over, and then under, and over, and then I go back, go over, under, and then over, over, under, and then over again. So you're just going to keep repeating this just until you reach the end of your braid, or just however much you want, and I'm just doing it like this. You could do it under, over, under, but I just like to do it over under over just that's what it's easier for me but depending on whatever is easier for you and as you can see it kind of gives it a different kind of look because two of my sections got bigger and two of the sections got small so it just creates a different effect but depending on what you do you can get a different effect or you can just get it normal and all the same size so I'm just gonna do this until I reach the end of my braid which is coming soon as you can see, I am just tying it off with a little hair tie, and I'm just going to fluff up my braid a little bit just to make it a little bit looser and not so tight and just like, I just want it looser, so I'm just going to do that until I'm happy with it, like so. So you can see when I puff it up, you can see the two small strands and then the two bigger strands, how it creates a different kind of look. So I'm just going to do that, and then... I'm going to have a side ponytail, so I'm just putting all my hair to my right, and then I'm just going to make sure that my braid is laying down the way I want it to, and then I'm just going to take another little hair tie and just secure it so that I have a ponytail, a side ponytail I mean, but I'm just going to do this, and then I'm just going to take out a little piece of my bangs because I don't like it to be in the... Um, side pony so I'm just going to take it out and then I am done with my hair. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to subscribe comment or rate if you have requests or any questions for me just leave them in the comments. Don't forget to follow me on all my social networks the links will be in the description box below and if you try this out I would love to see your recreation so please send me a picture to my Instagram or my Twitter whatever I don't really care but yeah I would love to see your recreation so just send me a picture. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed watching how to create this four strand braid. And yeah, I will see you next week with a nail tutorial and another hair tutorial that rhymed, kind of. But anyways, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.